Um, no, um, most people have heard about the uh, glycated proteins that people get in diabetes or, or aging. They call them the uh, AGE. Uh, right, adva- advanced glycation end products? Yeah. yeah. And, uh, <coughs> excuse me. Those stick to certain uh, parts of protein molecules, and it happens that carbon dioxide also has a spontaneous ability to attach to those uh, same groups. And if carbon dioxide is abundant, you can't get glycation because carbon dioxide is protecting that. Group. There you go. Huh. And it's it's also the the higher carbon dioxide in the blood will help you utilize your oxygen better. I mean, within normal levels. Obviously, if you have too high of a level of carbon dioxide, it'll probably cause problems. Um, yeah, it delivers oxygen to the cell. So it's still um, uh, stressing the importance of oxygen. It's just a higher carbon dioxide will allow the cells to absorb more oxygen. Yeah, for example, in the brain, uh, in proportion to how much uh, glucose you're oxidizing and how much carbon dioxide you're producing, uh, it not only releases the oxygen from the hemoglobin so it can get into the cell, but it, it, it relaxes the blood vessels so that more blood 